Hello, my name is Trub. I'm a wood dweller. I prefer to be called this over the other names the local villagers call me. Like Hermit, Hobo, oh, and that guy who eats the insides out of my pumpkins. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot to introduce the love of my life, that without her, I'd be nothing. Her name is Joe, and she is not a potato. Say hi, Joe. Joe, say hello! <sighs> Hello. The two of us get into some crazy situations, but in the end, we all have a good time. Yep. That's us. The Hobo and Joe. I'm not a hobo. I'm a wood dweller! Alrighty, Joe. Come on, get up. Today's that day, remember? What are you talking about? Well, that thing. Remember that thing I found last night? I wanted to show you. You wouldn't come out because it was nighttime, and... Well, I want to show you now. Alright, let's go look. Well, alright, come on, let's go. It's, it's just right over here. All right, so it's oh, it's over there in the little prancing field. You know that little field that we prance around in? You mean that you prance around in? Well, yeah, I know I prance around. I just kind of hold you. But yeah, no, um, I found something that didn't used to be there. All right, so get this. The ground, is, it's just not there anymore. What do you mean? Well, here, I'll show you. Let's just get over there. <gasps> well, oh, man, I envy you. I really do, Joe. I wish I could breathe underwater. I actually don't breathe at all. Well, whatever. All right, but yeah, look, it, it's just gone. Oh my, that is odd. I know, it's so strange. I don't even know what to do about it. I mean, should I do something about it? Well, something should be done, but what? Yeah, I know, I really should. I just, I'm not sure what, you know what, Joe? What? I just had an idea. Those are quite rare for you. Well, you, you know what? I, I know that what we live on is earth, right? This is true, yes. Well, I mean, the, the earth is made out of dirt and rock and sand and wood. I could fix it. I could fix the world. The world just happens to have a, 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 a boo-boo. Not sure there's anything you can do. Well, I mean, I could try and we could just try to fix it. Yeah, no, that's a great idea. I'm gonna get back to the house and get the stuff. <gasps> Oh, no, I'm, I'm a genius. I'm gonna fix the world. The world's got a wound, and I'm gonna fix it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it feel all that much better. <laughs> oh man, I'm a great person. I'm gonna fix the world. All right, let's get some uh, food just in case it starts to get a little dark, because I have a feeling some of the demons are gonna come out tonight. Let's just grab all the sand, the wood, and dirt. <laughs> oh, oh, Joe, I. I'm gonna fix the world. Can I help? Well, I mean, you can fix the world with me. All right, here we go. <gasps> well, all right. I mean, look, it's not even that big a hole. I mean, I should have enough material, and if I don't, I can just start using the wood. The ground's not wood. Well, that's true, but all right, let's just connect the sand with the sand. All right, here we go. Hey, the heck no. Wait, oh, well, that's strange. Well, what about, what about the dirt? Well, the dirt's fine. That's strange. I wonder why the dirt's fine and the sand isn't. Hmm. I don't get that. I don't get that at all. But I guess, well, this is my first time fixing the world. I, maybe I have to use a certain type of sand from a certain area in the world. I don't know. Oh, but, Joe, I mean, I, this could be my job. I could, I could start my own company. Oh, if my dad could see me now, he'd be so proud of me. He didn't think I'd amount to anything, but I could I could open a, a world-fixing business. If you got a wound and you're part of the world, let Trub come out and fix it. Oh, Joe, that just the, the, oh, the ring of it. Trub and Joe's world-fixing company. That name is horrible. Well, I mean, I guess I could work on it a little, but <laughs> I don't know. I, I really like the ring of it, and I would love to have you as my vice chairman. How does that sound, Joe? I'll get back to you about that. Well, I hope you can think about it. Just, I'll think about the name. I know that's probably the huge turnoff for you, but I, I think we can do this. I, oh man, we'll make millions, Joe, because I mean, there's so many different holes and divots in the world. All I got to do is get enough dirt to fix all the divots and I could win a, a, a prize of some sort, like a, what is it called? A, a Pulitzer. That's for journalism, Trub. Oh, I didn't know that. Well, that's cool. Ah, but maybe they have some sort of world-fixing prize. Oh, that's kind of scary. Good thing I'm not scared of heights. <laughs> I'm a little scared. All right, let's, uh, how do I do this? And, yeah, okay. Oh, this is, this is getting a little difficult. Oh, man. I don't know. I might not have enough dirt. I'm going to have to start using the wood. 
Maybe the sand will work up here. I, I don't know. Sorry, pink fella and seagull. If you can't get out of there in time, we're going to have to make you a cave dweller for the rest of your life. All right. It looks like you're staying in there. Bye. All right. This is going so well. Joe. Whoa. Oh, I thought... <laughs> oh. Okay. Well, no. You know what? I want I want the other pink little fella to have a friend. All right. Get in there. Nope. Get... Nope. Really, dude? All right. Here he goes. He's going to get back out there. Really? What a jerk. What a selfish jerk. I mean, look at him. He's all lonely down there. You'd think the other guy would want him to have a friend. Oh, I ran out of dirt. All right. Let's use the wood then. <laughs> process it, Trub. Oh, you know what? You're right. I should process it. All right, there we go. Oh, look how much wood I got now. You are a smart one, Joe. Thanks, Trub. All right, almost finished. Where's the sign? Oh, we're gonna beat the we're gonna beat the demons out before they uh, get outside tonight. I hate when they get out and start being jerks. They really can't be jerks. All right, we're almost done. Good. I'm getting tired. Joe, why are you getting tired? I'm the one doing all the work. All you're doing is sitting in my inventory. And look, we're almost done, and we are done. Look at that. Joe, we did it. We fixed the world. <laughs> oh, Joe, we are great people. I'm going to talk to somebody about uh, starting a business because, wow, I mean, we could we could make thousands of hundreds of dollars. Oh, all right, let's get back to the house, and uh, you can go back to bed. I, I don't even mind. You can lay in bed all you want. I feel like I've accomplished something today. I may have a splinter or two in my hand, but I've done it. I'm going to put you back in the house, and I'm, I'm just going to hang out in the pool today. Well, can I hang with? Oh, you want to hang out in the pool. Well, that's tough. I thought you were tired. <laughs> All right, there you go, Joe. I'm going to put you in bed. All right, there you go. Oh, come have on. Have a good night's sleep. I'm going to go hang out in the pool. Bye, Joe. <laughs> oh, I love this pool. Got to call the hobo babes over here. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you check out play.opcraft.net for more and hit that like button.